So, just how easy is it to exploit the Wii U and play your backed up games from the original DVDs to your memory card using loading? Um, as it turns out, incredibly easy. <laughs> let me uh, let me demonstrate. So, we just turn the uh, the Wii U on. Got a quick start option, of course. So, we'll just uh, go straight back to the menu. First, the boot. It's literally a case of having the right SD card files, including backups of your games, of course. Uh, that's because of my VWE hard drive that's hooked up onto the TV there. Uh, yeah, literally a case of having the right files and then knowing where to go on the web browser. So we'll go down here, get crack on with the web browser. You can host your own uh, site. Basically, it plays an exploited uh, video file and immediately loads into the homebrew lo loader or launcher, depending on what you want to call it. Uh, so you need to go into the address bar. If it wants to pull focus at some point. Anytime soon would be nice. There you go. Uh, you can host your own. But I'm personally just using a freeware one. Thanks to someone over at GBA Temp. So it's weubrew.com. That's the current working one. There you go. So it goes to play an exploited video file. There you go, so both screen display the same thing. Hit loading, load it up. I've only got a couple of games on there, I've only got an 8 gig SD card, that's going to change soon, obviously. <laughs> and uh, yeah, let's go for New Super Mario Brothers Wii U or not. Wii U even. You used to be able to use something called uh, WUD files, W-U-D, but now you have to sort of uh, extract the image. Uh, it's a little bit complicated, a little bit fiddly. I think the idea was they wanted to cut down on piracy, so you're only using your own games and all the rest of it. So, And, uh, yeah. There you go, running straight off the SD card. Fantastic. Hmm. Trouble free.